What's up guys, Jake Sleesman, Blue Collar Outdoors, and today we got another unboxing from our man Brent at Ohio Paracord and Bow Works. He's at it again, he sent us some more things. This is actually one's for me, one's for Hawk, and one's for Moose, so this is pretty cool. So stay tuned to see what he sent this time. Alright guys, so let me just cover that real quick. As you can see, he uh, he said not to do not open with anything sharp. He knows I like to cut them open with broadheads, and uh, he told me not to. He told me to rip it open, and then I see he's challenging me here because it's water and tear resistant. Challenge accepted. <laughs> so I'm gonna get this open. There we go. There she is. There she is. That's pretty cool. Okay, so what we got here, before I say it, or show it, little note, it reads, game drag sling works great to drag deer, hogs, bear, etc. Also works great to use as a turkey sling to carry turkeys out hands-free. I do like those. I also use it as a shotgun sling and carry it horizontal. Add carabiners to the loops and I've used them to carry in tree stands or climbing sticks. It looks like it says, uh... New cooler strap, and the uses are unlimited. So, what we got here, he sent three. Each in a different color. There you go there. And then you can see here he's got tied the paracord on with a game loop. Honestly, I'll probably use this as a duck strap. And, uh, I mean, this, this is impressive, but <laughs> as you can see, you got that right there. This is the orange one. I may have to claim this one. This one's nice. Then we got like a woodland camo. Just your green and your brown. Same deal. And the last one is got a little camo to it. Let me get this to focus on it. Got a little camo to it. I mean, this is this is really good work, man. This is impressive. And I, I believe they're all the exact same size. Like he, like he said, he wanted to get Hawk, Moose, and myself all one. So what I'll do is I'll have to have them over and they'll get to pick and see what they like. I'm, I'm almost just going to take this orange one because that one just that has got my height. I like that. But all of these are pretty le legit. Once again, Brent, huge shout out for sending these. I mean, you've sent us a ton of stuff, and it's pretty cool to see the paracord side of things. I mean, these are really impressive. That's a tight, tight weave. I, drop a comment below. Let me know how long it takes to make one of these, because I've always been curious how long it actually takes, because, I mean, guys, look at that. You got to do, you got to do that all the way up and around. Then you got to tie this in and then tie that down there. That's got to take some time. I, I'm going to guess a couple hours, but I don't know. You've probably done a bunch of these, it looks like, because every one of these is top-notch. But I'm just curious to see how long it took you to make these. And then with that said, Brent, huge, huge thanks from Hawk, Moose, and myself for making us each pretty much a utility par paracord carrying system. Because, I mean, like you said, you can carry anything with this. I'm going to try to use it for ducks. I bet you I can strap them in and just carry them out like this. The turkey toad will definitely be used as, and I'm going to try it out carrying sticks as well, as Moose could use this to carry his sticks with his new saddle. So, I mean, it's pretty cool what you can do with paracord, and especially when you're good at it, like this right here, you get top-notch performance, and that yields unlimited uses so i mean let, there's the three right here let me get this one off there's the three right there i mean these things are top notch bud once again thank you i can't wait to break them in and then uh we'll do a review on them after season and after turkey season getting to use this because i i can already see how how many things on the top of my head i can use this for is just ridiculous so thanks again man you're always coming in clutch sending us stuff it's nuts, and we appreciate it more than we can actually put into words. I, I just, 
I haven't found the right words yet. I will, but it means it means more than you know. But guys, drop a comment below. Give Brent a shout out again for once again hooking us up with a PO box delivery. Uh, this one's pretty cool. I mean, every single one of them has been awesome. I mean, he sent ammo, he sent chokes, he sent arrows, broadheads, and now carrying systems for all of us. I mean, dude, that's clutch. I hope you're healing up good. I hope you're getting out, getting a field. And uh, I'm eager to see how long it takes you to make one of these because that's some good work right there. We will do a review of these down the road. I want to break them in and get using them, see what we can do with them. And, well, actually, I guess I should say see what we can't do because, I mean, I can't really think of anything that's going to be limited with this right here. It's pretty awesome. But, guys, we're pushing for 10K subscribers. We're almost there. So if this is your first video with us, hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. Turn it to all notifications. As 13% as of this video has the notification bell on. 10% have their notifications on to all. There's going to be some changes in the upload schedule coming, as you guys are aware. So make sure you have your notifications on and all so you do not miss out on any hunts that are going to be dropping. We are working on filming waterfowl hunts as well. Uh, Dylan from Hooked on Fishing and Justin, they both were the owner, co-owner of Hooked on Fishing. They came with us for opener, and we've gotten out a couple times after that, hammered some ducks. He put a video up on his channel. I'll put the link down in the description below. But I got to get tip my hat to those guys on YouTube filming waterfowl hunts consistently. I mean, that filming deer and turkey, that's hard. But filming waterfowl is the hardest thing I've ever tried to do. It really is because they're so fast. And those guys that consistently pump out content, man, that's impressive. Now, having seen and tried firsthand and failed, we are trying to figure out how to do it the best we can. We do have all the shot cam footage, but we're trying to figure out how we can film the whole experience. Oh man, it's 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 tricky, but we'll get there. We're still learning waterfowl on top of trying to learn how to film it as well. So it's only complicating things, but challenges make you better. So it's it's been an absolute awesome experience. As always, smash the thumbs up button for your boys. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Hit that little notification bell, make it go ding. Turn it to all. So you do not miss out on any videos we drop, as we are a very active channel. I think we're over 600 videos now, believe it or not. It's been nuts. Just nuts. But share these videos with your friends. Let's get BCO Nation to 10K. Share all these videos. Well, actually, comment below your favorite test of this year. It doesn't matter if it's a broadhead pattern test. It do doesn't matter what it is. Drop your favorite test this year or the one that shocks you the most. I'm eager to see what you guys thought, and I, I kind of want to see uh, what test you guys were loving the most. But guys, it's Jake Sleesman, Blue Collar Outdoors, and we will catch you on the next one. Have a good one.